Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So the Windows Copilot is a feature that Microsoft has already been testing now in the Windows 11 Insider program. And as I have been posting, at this stage, it's very much in its early stages of development, and there is a lot of work to go before this does actually roll out to the stable version. Now, what the Copilot does is it does bring centralized AI assistance to the Windows 11 desktop. And the Copilot is basically a web container on the Windows 11 desktop that is very similar to the new Bing chat with the chatbot ChatGPT as an example. Now, as I have also been posting over the last couple of months, the Microsoft Edge web browser for desktop seems to be becoming almost its own operating system. And that's because Microsoft has been rolling out a lot of new features to the desktop browser. And it almost seems that one day we won't actually need an operating system because it'll all be available in the Microsoft Edge web browser. And I have tongue-in-cheek called a couple of videos previously Edge OS. Now, in regards to the Windows Copilot and the Edge OS, it seems now that um, a very similar feature will be making its way in the future to the Edge web browser for desktop. And as I have posted previously, Windows Copilot, um, one of the things it, it will uh, let you do is it will let you um, control the actual Windows settings. And now in the future, using the Bing chat from the sidebar and the side panel, uh, you may have the option to soon change different browser settings from the Bing chat pane in the sidebar and the side panel. Now, this has been spotted in Edge Canary version 117, which is the latest preview version. And at this stage, is not available in my region because like a lot of these new features, they are um, rolled out using a phased staggered controlled rollout. But nonetheless, to give us a general idea, and we're going to head over to some screenshots provided by Leo over on Twitter, which will give us a general idea as more or less what to expect. Now, yeah, we can see using these side bar with the uh, the Bing chat. As an example, if you type in V tabs, short for vertical tabs, and you click on the the uh, respond button, um, the so-called um, co-pilot in the Edge web browser will be able to open those vertical tabs, very similar to what it's going to be able to do on the Windows 11 desktop. And if you type in horizontal tabs, and we just wait for that to respond, uh, you will see that it closes the vertical tabs and then it opens up those horizontal tabs once again. So that's one of the three examples we're going to look at today. Then moving on to the next, something else it will be able to do. If you type in down hub, short for downloads hub, you click on the respond and there we go. Uh, it will also be able to open up your downloads hub as another example. And the third example, if we head to that and you type in add, all to collections. So basically what this is going to do, uh, it's going to let you be able to add those open pages to your collections, add all to collections. And there we go. Just wait, give it a couple of seconds to respond and save pages to collection. And you can click on yes, and then you can add your open pages to any relevant collection. So just a couple of features that um, could be rolling out in the future to a stable version. As yet, this is not available uh, in the Bing uh, the Bing chat side panel in the stable version. This is very much in its early days, very similar to the Copilot in the Windows 11 Insider program, very much in its early days, but just letting you know that um, you will soon be able to change different browser settings from the Bing chat pane in the Microsoft Edge web browser for desktop. So thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.